Sullivan. I'm a former IRS agent and teaching instructor with the IRS. Welcome to my YouTube station. It's the home of the five minute or less video. I thank you for watching today. I can tell you everything you need to know in five minutes. Uh, I have been on the national news a number of times. Many of you have come to me by uh, seeing me on the national news. You can go ahead and look at my whole team of former IRS agents and teaching instructors along with my news clips at 777irs.com. I do these videos for, for three reasons, and that is A, so you don't get ripped off. Uh, number two, I don't need to be in a fancy coat and tie with books behind me. I can just have my Cheetos behind me, which I'm going to eat when I'm finished. And I like to make these YouTube so I can educate you and to help you with the IRS problem you have. Many times I give you former IRS agent tips that you're really not going to get anywhere else. I have done this for 50 years. My team, if we add our cumulative years, have done this for a total of 200 and in 50 years. Today I want to talk to you today if you need help with your passport because it's been revoked or denied by the Internal Revenue Service and just some stuff to let you know. You know a couple of years ago, model about four or five years ago, they passed this FAST Act. It's a FAST job as far as I'm concerned. F-A-S-T and what they did, they decided that anyone over owed over serious debt to Internal Revenue Service, serious debt, was over $55,000. I don't consider that really serious debt. A lot of people can owe $55,000 in a heartbeat for one year. So what they've done, and then a really creepy thing as far as I'm concerned, they've gone ahead and suspended, denied, or, or contacted the IRS, contacted the State Department, and said, hey, we're not going to let these people uh, uh, fly anymore. We're contacting the State Department to suspend their passport. That's a bunch of crap. People have medical reasons that they have going over there. They have family that are sick. They have travel plans because they had one bad tax year. You're suspending, denying, or doing something, restricting their passport. What a bunch of crap this is. So anyway, at the end of the day, as former IRS agents, we, what we do is we can get these passport restrictions and get these passports uh, uh, status back to you as fast as humanly can. Now, when I say that, understand that we do our work within three days and it takes IRS at least probably six to seven weeks to do theirs. So how this process works is very simple. You get a 508C letter and it says, hey, guess what? Um, we filed the lien, you're getting your, uh, your passport restricted. We've already contacted the State Department, so what are you gonna do about it? Nothing, but there is something you can do about it. What you usually do is we get a power of attorney and uh, we call IRS and what we do is we take a personal financial statement and this is what's required. There's no other left or right turn or this or that. When we get your current financial statement, we call IRS immediately and we put your case in either currently non-collectible payment agreement or we file for an offer and compromise depending on what your financial statement supports. With that, what in fact we are doing, we're letting IRS know that we're trying to close your case and to get your passport back at the same time. So what IRS does is they're gonna look at this financial statement. We get documentation for it, like we get bank, uh, we get your, uh, your bank statements and uh, we get your income and expenses and we get on the phone and we tell IRS this person needs their passport back now and we need to get it back as soon as possible. So IRS says, well, okay, how do you want to close this case? Do you want to close it by a hardship, a payment agreement or an offer? Well, our job is just not to get your passport back. Our job in reality is to get your IRS case closed. Some people owe two, uh, 55000 some owe $4 million. So at the end of the day, 
uh, our job is to get your case closed by Internal Revenue Service. So if we can get your case in uncollectible where IRS suspends your activity for a couple years and then looks back at it, we will. If you want to make a payment agreement, we will. If we have to challenge the liability, we will. Or if we have to try to settle the debt through the offer and compromise, we certainly can do that. We have to make sure all your tax returns are filed. But at the end of the day, we have a very streamlined process process to go ahead and to get your passports back. This is the biggest bunch of crap I've seen. I've done this work for 50 years and what IRS is pulling to get your passport in and to basically hold your passport hostage is a bunch of crap. Anyway, at the end of the day, we can get this your passport back, reinstated to you faster than anybody in the business. Anyway, um, I'm telling you the truth. Uh, give me a call, get a free consultation. If this at least video was helpful to you to know you can get it back, give me a subscription. I'd really appreciate it. We do the work and we'll get this all back for you so you carry on with your plans. Thank you for the subscription. Have a good one. This thing really pisses me off that they've done this, as you can tell.